the man, the myth, the legend. Yes, y'all boys. Escanor. Super Awakened Escanor. And not only a Super Awakened Escanor, but a 6-6 six, six Super Awakened Escanor. Now, in today's video, guys, as you know, we are going to be showcasing this Super Awakened unit. I have also Super Awakened my boy, Blue Demon Meliodas, for certain purposes. Uh, let me change this real quick. There we go. There we go. We want that additional damage. But, so yes, this is what we are doing today. Uh... This is going to be fun, hopefully. I don't have all my units Super Awakened, so it's going to put me at kind of a disadvantage because I'm pretty sure everybody has Super Awakened units. I did not have enough coins. I ran out of Plat Coins, and I had to actually use Gold Coins to get my melee uh, Super Awakened. So, we'll have to grind the Tower of Trials to get all those Super Awakening coins and, you know, start maxing our units out. But, anyway, let's get into this video. But before we do, if you are new to the channel, make sure to smash that subscribe button down below. Join the subscribers on the grind to 1,200, guys. We all welcome you with warm, a warm welcome and a warm hug. I love you, and go ahead and join the subscribers right now by hitting that subscribe button down below. And also, drop a like down below. You're going to enjoy this content. Anyway, let's get into the video. Time to smack some glue leaders. All right, man, please don't stress me out. Is that Red Merlin? Is that Red Merlin? Oh, it's Green Merlin. Oh! Hmm. 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 This is questionable. This is actually questionable. Can we kill that Merlin? Can we kill that Merlin? No, we cannot. We cannot kill that Merlin. 46k. Nice. And we have our ult. Take off my ult gauge or you're dead. And if you take off my ult gauge, I'm just gonna switch. Be able to take off your ult gauge and then attack the table. Because you have no cleanse. And then I'm gonna get... I can't get Escanor's ult, actually. No, I can. If an Escanor card drops. Please, Escanor card. Please, Escanor card. Please, 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 please. please. Scared, I see. Okay. So here's what... We oh, buddy. You have... I think we could break that shield with a, uh, with this, can we? Do this and then this. I think we could break that shield. Yeah, nah, this might be bad. Can we break? Yes! Yo, I was a little bit scared. Okay, nice, nice. That was a little, that was a smart attempt. Okay, uh, okay, it's looking good, looking good, looking good. Hmm. We're gonna rank up our, um... This is the most annoying thing ever. Like... Bro, what are you gaining from this? You're just gonna keep doing the same thing over and over? I mean, yeah. I mean, I guess. It's the game. Uh, so here's what I'll do. Rank up Lilia. Take off that shield. Level 3. Take off 3 ultimate move gauge so you can stop putting that shield on and actually use your brain for a little bit. This is not a glue eater. Certainly he does play like one. That's like, that's like his, uh... Yeah, this is good. We have all, all ults, but he, he could kill my Eskimo. So, this is literally like... This is just like Goddess List, except not Goddess List. Like, a shield is not as strong. You can take off ult. Why would you take off ult of somebody that's dead? There's no way. Oh, I thought he, I thought he thought that Escanor was dead. I was about to say, bro, you're sleeping. Why didn't you take off the ult of somebody you weren't gonna kill, though? It's my question. All right. So here's what we'll do. First, we will heal. Then we'll do this. I'm sorry if my, if y'all hear my dog barking. Then we'll do this. All right, heal our health back. Here's a three-star card. Ah, oh, that, that uh, Merlin is dead from my Gother's ult. I think my uh, my Gother is actually 4-6 maybe? I'm on the verge of getting him uh, 6 out of 6. I know that for sure. So, let's see what we got, baby. Where's my music? Okay, nice, nice, nice. You killed my Escanor. I can't believe you killed the person I'm showcasing. And then you have an Escanor in the back. <laughs> Why? Why do you do this to me, man? What did I do to deserve this? Oof. Attack table. Okay, that's fine. You're not gonna get ult for a while since I have uh, had combined ultimate with Gother, so I took off five ult gauge. So here's what I'll do. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'll rank up Gother. 
attack disable, and then AoE, kill your uh, Golter, and then the only thing you can do is a Cruel Sun, basically. So, let's see what you do. Let's see what you do. There is nothing you can do with all those level 3s, buddy. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. This game is basically over. Uh, but I'm gonna play it through. I'm not gonna skip it. I'm gonna play it through. Why, bro? Because I'm gonna do it again, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. I wish I was showcasing my beautiful Eskino right now. But, you know, he got zapped that fast. Literally. They just he went for him. He was so scared of the Eskimo. He was scared of the S66 Super Awakened Eskimo. He wasn't having it. Alright. So, yeah, this match is over. I'm just gonna actually skip to the next one. By the way, don't worry about the win to loss ratio. I was, I was actually experimenting with teams that weren't Super Awakened, so like, I came into every team and got bopped. It was bad. Oh. Oh. So, what you fail to realize is. I'm gonna rank up my Escanor. Rank up my Gopher. Rank up my Lilia. Because I know he's gonna try to rush ult. And then I'm gonna attack Sable. Put up a shield, boy! I'm gonna rush my Gother's ult as soon as possible, if possible. Now you're attacking Sable. You cannot stun me. You cannot attack with your Meliodas. And we have a abundance of Escanor attack cards. If we had a rank up, it would be so good. All right, but we don't. So we'll have to just settle. Level up, three star shield, two star shield. So I'm gonna break your shield, bro. This is the best thing about Escanor. I'm just gonna break your shield, bro. It doesn't matter how much you wanna put that shield on. I'm gonna break and then attack. I'm going to basically try to force. I'm gonna try to force the revive on his list. Is it gonna kill? Oh, he's dead. Nice. Okay, revive is forced. Next turn, she will be dead. Yep. Next turn, she is dead. Don't matter what you put on. I am so sorry about my dog. I'm so sorry, y'all. <laughs> if y'all can hear my baby in the background. Please stop her! Stop her! Oh, that's a fat stun. But it don't matter, bro. Know why? I actually don't want to kill her. If I kill her, I'll, I will be so, so stuck. How much help do you have? One star cool stun shouldn't kill. Yeah, it shouldn't kill. It really shouldn't. But I'm scared it will. If it does, it's okay. It's not okay because Gother will get ult. But... It's a risk I have to take. I need to attack Disable. Okay, nice. Of course, it's not going to kill because of the shield. I forgot I wasn't two-star. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. All right, now we have a three-star takeoff old cage. Ooh! Ooh. I, I'm looking... I'm not even going to lie. This is looking bad. Too many of these, my guy. And at the same time, it's looking good. Because next turn, we have Lilius ult. And we have, we have, we could actually force ult on Gother and, yeah. Let's see what he does. He's gonna put up a shield. Three star shield. Oh, a three star sun. Blue eaters, man. I, I'm not even gonna lie. Blue eaters. There's nothing you can do about it. Gee, you. Okay, he didn't put up a shield, though. Uh, but he does. He does, in fact, have. Oh, wait. I think we win. Do this. How much health do you have? How much health? 24k. Oh my god, bro. This will kill. And then we'll corrosion. I'm gonna get a three star cool sun. Ah, my Escanor is dead actually. There's nothing I can do about that. Escanor is dead. I mean, we forced. Th See, that's the only thing I don't like about uh, Elizabeth. The fact you have to force the revive, and if she just keeps shielding over and over and over again, it just stalls the match. So we'll just go to the next match. We lost. I extremely dislike Goddess Liz so much. I'm so I'm not even gonna go back in on our banner. I'm saving for the one. Like I'm literally just gonna save for the one. There's no point in going back on my banner. Okay, can we kill him? Can we kill him? 
Should we kill Kia? How many? How much health do you have on Kia? 65k? Attribute disadvantage. Can we kill? I don't like getting ignited. Can we kill that Kia? This is an experiment, guys. If I lose, it's it's literally my fault. 13k. Yeah, we're not killing. This is a one shot in that. Ooh. Almost. We have ult now. He can't take off ult. He can dissolve, though. I mean, he could try to go for a kill onto my uh, Escanor. Ooh, and we have a, a double rank up. We can attack the Sable. And you have nobody to cleanse the attack the Sable. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. It's looking good. That actually critted a lot. Buddy. Almost. You almost did it. Now, here's what I'll do. I'm ranking up. Ranking up everybody. Then I'm gonna attack disable you. And then next turn I'll heal. But can we kill? Let me see how much I'll heal. 82k. We're not killing him. Let's kill that Golden. Alright, the reason I know we're not killing him, attribute disadvantage. And even though my Escadron is 6'6, it just I don't know why it does not it's not hit a lot. Okay. Alright, so yeah, you're dead. That's it. Oh maybe we actually killed. I well, we would have killed, actually. Ah, oh, he has Kyo's ult! I mean, he has attack disabled, at least. But he's going to kill... My Lilia, or... No, he's killing... He's gonna kill Golther. If he doesn't kill Golther, why would he not kill Golther? Yeah, he's kill... He's gonna try to kill Golther. If he has if he has a 6-6 six, six Kyo, I'm dead. Okay, he didn't kill, but... He's gonna kill the next attack. Ooh! I know Escanor cards, it's okay. Oh my god, can we clutch? Bro, this dude just gave me the opportunity. Alright, so here's what we do. We cleanse, attack the table again. No, we don't need to. We don't need to. I really wanted to just get these, uh, these right here. Cleanse, do this. And I guess we could combine. Yeah, let's combine, let's combine. Cleanse, get our health back with our Gother. Nice, nice little health. And then Kyo should be dead. Yeah, Kyo's dead. Nice, nice, nice. Death Pierce in a back to increase the, uh, I mean, decrease my crit, my crit resistance. That's why he was critting so much on my Escanor. Okay, that's like that's OP. I want to super awaken my Death Pierce now. Ooh. Stop! Okay, nice. Yo, yo, that man made sure. Okay, I know how dangerous this guy actually get. So here's what I'll do. Waste this card. Waste this. I don't want to crit that melee because that will make it, it would make it to where I he can bring it back literally with ease. So I'm just gonna move cards and not crit that melee. Because I, I don't know how many cards he has, and I don't have time to lose just from doing one turn. He gets three AoEs, or two AoEs, and then I'm just basically at a very bad dis Yeah, I would have been bad. I think I'm dead either way, though. Yeah. Okay. And then he heals, like, fully. Don't crit. If this doesn't crit, I'll be fine. Do this. Then we heal. If this doesn't crit... Melly, Wolf. Nah, it, it's gonna crit. There's no way. Oh my god, it didn't crit. Nice! And we have our ult. Nice. And we have to take off ult gauge. Alright, guys. This match is done. This match is done. Or is it? Or is it? <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> Bro, I'm so scared. Now, I actually wanna play this through because he might clutch. Okay. So he has ranked up cards. We'll de-rank those and then take off Oak Gage per de-rank. Then take off more Oak Gage. Because we're just like that. We're just that good. Give me that. Give me that Oak Gage, baby. And then we'll take three more. Give me the... It's a good thing I didn't heal. Yo, that man would have had Oak and Clutch. Yo! And he was probably just thinking like, yeah, I'm gonna Clutch. Yeah, no way. He would have clutched. Alright, now the match is actually over. Alright, guys, let's get to the next one. 
All right, this is my last one. I've actually had enough of blue eater teams. Like I'm, I'm so, I'm not even gonna play PVP. Like until the one Escanor comes out, I'm not playing PVP because I'm not, I'm not going against this every single match. It's just not, it's not bearable. Like yeah, super awakened, super awakened Escanor is, he's good, but no, bro. I'm not going against this every single match. There's no way. Let's try to get this list though. Can, hello? Like, bro, I, yeah, I just don't know, bro. It's just crazy. Crit. No crit. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. I mean, if he stuns my, uh... Nah, it's looking like he's just ranking up to try to get ult. I'm gonna take off old gauge. I'll take off three old gauge so that uh, I won't have to worry about him just keep rushing over and over again. So here's what we'll do. We'll break this shield on his melee. Slide this over. Take off old gauge. I think this just breaks shield in general. But like just to be sure. I'm gonna hit I'm gonna hit that melee. Yeah, it breaks shield in general. Take all off uh, three old gauge off of everybody. I'm just done, man. Glue eaters, glue eaters, just no. A anybody that uses Goddess Liz and just keeps just doing the same. <laughs> all you had to do was not summon on the banner. Keep PvP diverse instead of seeing this winged rat everywhere. Why? And he's rushing ult again, again. I'm attack disabling. I'm taking off three ultimate move gauge and attack disabling. You're not gonna do anything, buddy. <gasps> Let's go! Look at my health! Oh my god, bro. This is Pog Champ. Hmm. I'm actually not gonna attack disable yet. The reason to being is because I need to heal my Escanor. So I'm going to heal and then take off Oak Age and then attack Disable if possible. That wasn't even enough. Probably should have just... Probably should have just attacked Disable. Okay, either you stun my Lilia or you die. Uh, Either way, I think, I think this favors in me. Uh, unless he gets a 3-star shield or a 3-star stun. Okay... He's shielding? Okay, Escanor's not quite dead. Yes, stun! That is what I was waiting for you to do. Okay, nice. So here's what we do. I know that... So, I want to kill Goddess Liz, right? And then after, I want to immediately attack Disable. I don't want to attack Disable her right now, and then, you know, kill her. And then the debuff is removed. So we'll kill her right now. Waste the revive. Attack Disable. And you are not able to do anything besides rank up and attack disable me. And your attack disable may not kill my Eskin, depending. Please. I mean, even if he does, Lilia live. If if Lilia can live, we will be pretty in a good situation. If Lilia can live, look how long this match is. Just from one revive and some shields. I don't know why you did that. Thanks, bro. So you just like, uh, we'll rank up our gopher, attack disable. What health do you have? 65? Oh, you're dead. I'm killing you. Don't need Lost Vein in the fray. Even if Goddess Liz lives, I don't need Lost Vein in the fray. I really, I really hope this kills because if it doesn't, uh, she's just gonna heal. I didn't want to waste a full ulti to kill that one Liz with a little bit of health. This match may be so, oh, it's gonna be so long. It's gonna be so long. He has a Merlin in the back. I think we lost. I think we did lose. Kills.
attack disable. Three star attack disable. Oh, okay, 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 shield. And then three star attack disable. Okay, we heal, guys. That's it. Oof. Nah, bro. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Hopefully, my Goto doesn't die. I'm gonna heal a little bit. Hit. Take off old gauge. We, we're gonna get hit for a lot of damage. But we should be able to heal it back. He's. Ah, oh, come on, come on. Ah, oh, he took a little bit of a damage. It's okay. We took off old gauge. Doesn't matter. Enjoy your shield, bro. Okay. He's gonna stun my Lilia again. Or take off old gauge. Nice. I think he's gonna stun again. Dude, this match has literally been so long. I'm not touching PvP, bro. <laughs> what is this? What am I going against? Are you proud of yourself? No, it doesn't work like that. So this is what I'll do. Hope you're proud, bro. Go for, uh... Or, honestly, yeah, 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 let's do that, let's do that. So that if we get another, uh, one of these, we can attack the table. We're gonna lose a little bit of health. It's fine, though. It's a better trait than nothing. It's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt a little bit. Yeah, it's gonna hurt. Okay. We got three star stun, so we're not gonna wake up for a while. Yeah, it's a good thing I saved this, so I can combine that. Then I could corrode. Yep, it's just a battle of attack disabling at this point. Literally. Look at this, bro. What is the reason? All you had to do was not summon. That was well played. I think I lost. I lost. I can't believe it. He has got the better. He has got the better. Alright guys, I'm done. This was fun guys. Thank you everybody who came out to watch this video. And I am probably not going to touch PvP for a while. Super Awakened Eskinoor was really cool. I feel like maybe in UR, with UR gear, being able to actually one tap stuff would just make it way better. But other than that, yeah, this was just... Going against Glue Eaters 24-7 was not it. So yeah guys, uh... Pin in this meta, too, by the way, is good. Depends on how you run it. It was really, really good in 4v4. But 3v3 is, since you can't run, like, three pin units, and then, like, you know, do three pin attacks at one time, which causes literally obliteration, it's kind of not not viable in this meta, especially against Glue Eaters. I really need somebody who can one-shot, or you just need to play exactly what they play, which is Lost Vein, Goddess Liz, and Blue King. And I'm not playing that. I refuse. But Super Awakened Eskinoor was fun. It was fun in a couple matches until we started getting a lot of Goddess Liz. So anyway, thank you for watching this video. I hope you did enjoy. If you did enjoy it, go ahead and smash the subscribe button down below. You'll be getting more Grand Cross content as well as Genshin content. You will love it. Join the subscribers on the ground in 1200. And also, hit that like button down below. Anyway guys, I am going to go cry and literally vent on Twitter about how Blue Eaters are so ass. Peace out.